I've been on hold for like an hour and a half. Aeroplan. Good morning, beautiful people. What is happening? It's actually a gorgeous day today here in Vancouver. But I'm in the process of trying to get a whole bunch of my Aeroplan cards, you know, compiled together because I got like three or four of them over the years. I also got like an Aeroplan visa. So I'm hoping to get it all into one number in one card. But it's been a challenge because I've been on hold for like an hour and a half. Wicked, that was brilliant. After two and a half hours on the phone, they finally got all my accounts sorted out. So, which is nice because I got a crap load of points in there. Finally, we can take a vacation with the family. Hey guys, what's happening? It's almost lunchtime, but I can't eat at home. I actually got to go to an eye doctor's appointment. My eye is really sore. Um, I got to get this sorted out. But I had a quick break, quickly shot a, a review for one of my other channels. I'll come back and edit later on, but first things first, let's head out to the doctors. Hi right, fam, just here at the doctor's office. Hopefully it won't take too long. I still gotta go to the specialist. I'm gonna find out if I was supposed to call them or they're supposed to take care of it. I don't even know. Problem here in Canada is getting into specials and stuff takes forever. We got a great medical plan, but the system itself sucks. It takes forever if you need to get in to see a specialist for special appointments. Okay, one appointment done. Need some eye drops, a couple other chores. I'll call them chores because I can. Um, I gotta do some cleansing of my eyelids and stuff like that. And yeah, still gonna they're gonna find out about the specialist appointment. Um, like I said, you know, here in the 604 area, yeah, it's very difficult to get into these specialty appointments. It takes forever. So I want to get my eyes sorted out because um, hate walking around with headaches, you know what I'm saying? While I'm here, actually, my doctor is just across the street, so I'm going to go in there and book an appointment uh, to go see her as well. Okay, fam, I'm all done. So now I'm going to grab some lunch, head home, and then go straight to work. I don't know, what should we eat? I need something healthy, something saladish. So I don't know, I'll figure it out. I've been craving some agudashi tofu from a sushi place that I went to a while back. So I'm gonna get that today. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna get. Sushi. Fam, this is what we call a perfect lunch. I got United on the TV, winning 1-0. Sushi, well, there's that spicy agudashi tofu. Got some uh, tuna sushi and some California roll. Absolute epicness. So I'm gonna quickly munch, head downstairs back to work. Oh, what is happening to beautiful people? It's almost four o'clock. I'm gonna have to go pick the girls up. Usually later than usual, I'll try to get them by 3.30, but I've been tied up with work. To be honest, I need a break. I'm gonna put some jaw in my cup. And you know what that means, guys? Jaw talk. All right, guys, look. Everyone wants to do better. Everyone wants to improve. I get it. But there's a method to it and there's a methodology to it. And the easiest way I can explain it is the way I do it. This is again not right or wrong. It's just the way I do things and maybe this may apply for you, right? So the reason why I vlog every single day is because I'm trying to become a better public speaker. I really want to go up in front of big crowds and speak. Um, what I want to speak about, I don't know yet, but that's one of my goals. And I am shit scared of going in front of a crowd and speaking, believe it or not. Uh, when I first started vlogging, it was the hardest thing for me to do. Pick up a camera in public and talk to the camera. I'm getting better and better as I do it every day. Again, the key is doing it every day. So no matter what it is that you're trying to do, if you take it into small chunks and do a tiny bit every single day, right? I guarantee you over time, you're gonna get better and better and improve in what you're, you know, in what you're looking to do. So for example, when I first started vlogging to where I'm now, which is what, since August, whatever, how many months that is, I personally feel a lot more comfortable in front of the camera. I'm not as good as I can be, 
But again, I'm improving every single day because I'm doing it every single day. Let me give you another example. I know quite a few of you are always wondering, how can I be better on social media? How can I get a better following on Facebook or Twitter, whatever it is? Again, it's the same thing. You gotta do it little by little every single day. And what does that mean? On social media, you gotta be active on social media. Social media is about being social and social media is a lifestyle. And that's the other thing you guys need to understand. No matter what you're trying to improve, it's a lifestyle change. If you wanna lose weight, it's not gonna happen overnight. Again, it's small, subtle changes over time and it's a lifestyle change. I'll take vlogging, for example, right? Let's go back to that. So it's a small, small changes every day that make me better, but vlogging is a lifestyle change for me. I'm not used to this. I'm a totally different person when I started vlogging in August than I am now. If you wish to acquire wealth, again, the same thing. It's gonna take time. You gotta do small little steps over and over and over again. And again, it's a lifestyle change. Guys, I heard a magical quote, which I live by. Everything that you want is just outside your comfort zone. And it's absolutely true. To get to that comfort zone, again, small little steps every single day and over time, I guarantee you, you'll accomplish it. Now, one caveat, and this is the main one, and I say this all the time, it's not gonna happen overnight. So please don't message me and say, oh, I've been on social media for three months and you know, nothing has happened. You know what, I've been on social media since social media's come around. And I'm, you know, and I'm slowly progressing every single year. See, this game of life is all about making small, subtle movements and just sticking with it. And I will say it again, I repeat, do smaller things that improve you every single day and stick with it for the long term. And I guarantee you, you'll see results. Oh man, looks like the gorgeous day turned into a rainy day. Um, we do have a rainfall warning, I think, this week, uh, which which sucks. But anyways, let's grab the girls and then um, gotta grab them dinner. All right, guys, you want Subway or nuggets and fries? Uh, nuggets and fries. Huh? You know what that snake would do? What snake? That snake. What about would it? Would cut, take a paper and cut off your chin and your eyeball, and when with the knife. I'll cut off your arm and your leg and your foot. <laughs> That's a dangerous snake. Hey girls, you good? Good? All right, they're munching away. I'm gonna go downstairs and continue to work. Plus I got my mastermind meeting today. Um, looking forward to that. Some cool things to discuss with the with the guys. Oh man, busy day today. I just picked up Risa from the skating class. She wasn't too happy because I showed up late. Poor thing was out in the cold, but she's she's all right. She's gone upstairs, she's gonna shower, go to bed. Um, I'm pretty much done too, done all my work. Uh, mastermind meeting was awesome today. We got some big things coming up. Uh, looking forward to that. Uh, but for now, I'm gonna go upstairs because Suits is on today. I'm gonna sit down and watch a wifey. But I want to say if you're watching the vlog for the very first time, you know what? Thank you very much. I greatly appreciate it. Please subscribe to be part of the family. Of course, to my peeps, be you. Stay optimistic. Enjoy the rest of your night. Here's a big high five from me to all of you.